Down on the high school level, it's winner go home time. On the boys' side of things, the by district round getting underway tonight. On the girls' side, we're already three rounds deep. And the fun part about this, numerous Brazos Valley programs are still alive on the girls' side, not just one or two. So win tonight means the likes of College Station, Rudder, Franklin, Anderson, Shiro, and Buffalo are regional tournament bound. The only problem here, folks, some of those squared off against each other, a.k.a. Buffalo and Franklin, which you saw we'll get to in just a minute. Let's start, though, in Class 5A with a top 25 showdown between College Station and Pflugerville first. Quarter action, Alexis King, one of the senior leaders, steps up, buries the mid-range jumper. That's Aaliyah Collins with the jump shot there. The senior made plays all night long for the Cougars. More ball movement from the road team. Rebecca Haley underneath to Collins. Like I said, she played a huge role in this one. Panthers, they're ranked 13th in the state for a reason. Sheridan Bostic picks off the pass. She's off to the races, coast to coast, kissing it off glass. Coach Simak wants a timeout after that play. More from Pflugerville. London Collins goes baseline off glass. College Station trailed for the majority of this game, but they battled back in the final seconds. They take the lead, and College Station is moving on with a 75-74 win. So we're one for one. Can we go two for two to the Class 5A Regional Quarterfinal scoreboard? No, now we're one and one. Rudder coming off a big upset win. Lady Rangers can't quite move on. They go down to Magnolia West, 58-32. The game of the night tonight was in Class 3A with an all Brazos Valley showdown between Franklin and Buffalo. That is not that, though. This Looks is like we got College Station, college station. here. Uh, that's Kate Corton. There here you go, we go. Mike. Go for it. That's Franklin and Buffalo. Combined the teams 66 and 4 this season in for a great showdown. Scoreless game in the first. Tiana Wade gets inside, breaks the scoreless tie for the Lady Lions. More from them. Maya Booker hurt her ankle. On Friday, she's back and doing what she does best, scoring there. Before you knew it, Franklin up 7-0. The Bison, though, battling back. Samantha Pate with space. Samantha Pate with three points. The senior has reigned for days. We've seen the outside game. How about the inside game? Asia Bradley drives, shoots, scores. It's a two-point game. Final seconds of the first quarter. Now Sierra Wade, known for her inside action. She pulls up from deep. It's cash money. Franklin is moving on. They beat Buffalo 61-49. Let's go to some more scores. Staying in 3A, Anderson Shiro still alive after beating Die Ball by five points in Class 2A. Somerville season coming to an end tonight as the Yewas drop tonight's game to Mason. Mason, the second-ranked team in the state. All right, boys fun. Now, again, this is the by district round for them, number 18. College Station taking on Montgomery, and it's all Cougs in this one. Cade Corton does it all, folks. Dry dish Reagan Browning. It's not about him. Check out Patrick Chu flying in for the rebound and the putback. More from Chu in a minute. Corton, again, number 35, folks, makes him go. Drive, dish, told you about Chu, corner pocket three. Count them all, baby. They're off and running is College Station. More from 35. Gets into the paint this time. Corton up and in off the glass, plus the harm and the foul. He is special to watch. Quick passing now by College Station. Inside to who else but Corton. Outside to Chu. Other corner. Same result. All nylon. You're going to watch Corton hit a step back three here, and you get the drill. 75-42. It's all Cougars. Other class 5A action, 20th ranked Rudder facing Montgomery Lake Creek. Rangers hot starting this one. CJ figures over here in the corner, gonna drive baseline, finger roll, up and in, off the glass. Now we're out running, KJ Cunningham, ahead of the pack, gets the layup to go. More from the Weaver State commit here shortly. Then figures, same play, drives, but this time kick it out, Devion Lee. Yeah, top of the key, three, and he drains it in. Lions trying to hang around, Pierce Spencer. Great name, great shot, swishes home the deep three, but it's a little too late. Nick Smith, again, out running ahead of the pack, lays it up and in. I can't lie to you folks, pull up the score as you see Cunningham, give it up, get it back and slam it home. Rudder a winner if we can pull up the score, 68 to 49. To the scoreboard we go, staying in Class 5A, a and Consolidated beat Willis 74 to 60 in Class 6A, Pflugerville Hendrickson beat Bryan 55-45. We're going to go to some Class 3A highlights between Buffalo and Franklin on the boys' side. This game was close as we went through in the fourth quarter. It's an 11-point game. Franklin ends up pulling off the win in this one. We're being told we're over. They win by 17. Franklin, your by district champs. All right. And Allen Academy tonight at home 
also gets the win over Galveston. They are moving on as well. Aggie baseball also wins as well by a score of 5-3. to three. A lot of action tonight, a lot of teams in our area yeah. won, a lot of teams lost. we got to go to break.